Hello everyone and welcome to City of Cars. Today we're going to be doing another walk around video this time around on a 2021 Chevrolet Silverado. Uh, now this is going to be a uh, Trail Boss Edition which definitely kind of gives it a nicer look. It's a Z, uh, Z71 package. Gotta love those red toe hooks in the front. Definitely give it a lot of presence especially with that blue. I want to say it's like North Sky Blue Metallic Paint is the official name color for it. Somebody correct me in the comments if I got that wrong, but absolutely beautiful looking truck. Gotta love like the red decals, the blackout wheels. It definitely is a pretty truck. Um, got the custom badging on the back. Obviously, it actually does come with a spare tire. So if you look underneath here, you actually do get a spare tire. Um, gotta love the side steps, making it easy to hop in the bedside. Does have a, uh, a cover already on. Definitely a beautiful truck. Um, well, let's go ahead and kind of get into the video. Uh, looking up front here, obviously, this is a pre-owned vehicle. It's got about 22,000 miles. So I always kind of like kind of showing the lines, get a couple little nicks here and there, you know, just to be expected from the highway, but nothing major. Um, tires are all still really decent. Set of good year tires. If you look at the thread, you got plenty of uh, life left on those. Suspension, everything looks good. Definitely a pretty truck. Um, let's go ahead and take a peek at the tailgate itself underneath here. It does have a bed liner already built in. You got your uh, all weather floor mats there. It looks like somebody attached a little cargo thing there on both sides. That's kind of convenient. Uh, but that's there. Oh, actually, let's look at the line. The lip, as you can see, no corrosion. That's usually the first place it starts. And you can see that, that is nice and clean. Uh, let's go ahead and pull that back up. Do you see a little bit of a dent right there? Just to net, show it right there. There's a little little guy. Uh, do you want to point that out? Taking a peek. Looks like it is a fuelless cap system. Taking a peek at the rear seat area. You gotta love the amount of space trucks give you. I mean, these are huge. Um, you can lift these up. You get a little bit more storage space if needed. Definitely cool. Uh, some LED overhead lights. Gotta love that they kind of give you like kind of put a little dimple in the. Um, headrest or not headrest but a uh, headliner I should say that way if you're a little taller you do get a little bit more uh, headroom there obviously automatic window controls for the driver's side let's go ahead and lower the music down a bit there we go uh, it does have satellite radio I don't know who's paying for that but it is working as of right now but if we hit the home button get a couple things Android Auto Apple CarPlay that's all gonna be there for you um, got a type C USB you got a brake control already built in. You can lower the tailgate by just pressing that button. Uh, ba -ba -bum. Forward collision alert is on here. Obviously, you got your four wheel drive controls, your trailer assist. Uh, if you open up the glove box here, you got your owner's manuals. And you do get another glove box on this one here, which is kind of nifty. Uh, this is kind of a little jumper seat. You can use it at the third one, or you can, if I can find the handle here, without embarrassing myself. Oh, it's still this little tab right here. You can fold it down. Turns into a center console. You can open it up, get a little bit more space. Definitely convenient. Let's go ahead and put the seat belt on. Got a nice little handle there for the passenger. Definitely nifty. And you got more right here. Definitely part of the off road package. We do go off road and everybody can hold on tight. Um, seats are going to be manual. You do get adjustment here. If you want to slide up your chair, it's going to be this little lever here. Pull it up and you're good to go. Um, let's actually, that's a little too far forward. Uh, backup camera definitely works. You do got guidelines. They turn when you turn the steering wheel. Definitely nice. And if you're going to tow, you got like the just backing up and then just like the regular tow. So you can change the line depending on what you want to do. But putting it back in drive, and we're going to go ahead. And we're in a big off road truck, so we should have no problem just kind of going over the curve here. Just got to wait for that UPS truck to drive by. And whoop. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's normal. He's a really nice guy. All right, uh, we're gonna go ahead and hop over this. Boop. Boop. No trouble hopping over the curve. And we'll just take it for a quick drive around the block. I wanna say this is a 4.3 liter in this. Um, I think drive, gotta love how trucks drive, drive nowadays. They don't really feel like trucks, very cushy ride. You got the media tires around there, so you're gonna experience a little bit of road noise. It's just normal with like the off-road. Good, good your tires, but 
definitely a beautiful truck handles perfectly if i point this wheel straight look at that no no hands and the car's driving straight i'm gonna hit the brakes and no hands perfect so you don't got any warp rotors brake pads are good uh alignment's good definitely a beautiful car yeah and i'm barely and i love how easy this is just to kind of get it out of its own way like i barely feather the the accelerator and you start moving along so that is nice and there's norm again <laughs> and whoop. let's go ahead and squeeze by this a little bit a lot of traffic today but absolutely beautiful day in the great state of michigan taking a peek all around here definitely beautiful truck so let's go ahead and park this right back where i was do a little off-roading you can see there is a nice little dip of a hill there let's see if i can do that But as you can clearly see, that little dip is no big deal for this truck. It's definitely more than capable. Uh, we're going to pop the hood and do one last walk around on it. Um, you do get two sets of keys and fobs. Just so you see the key, it does that remote start. And you can also drop the tailgate from here, which is kind of convenient. Uh, we're going to turn the lights back onto automatic. Pop the hood. I love that Z51 badge, definitely a cool, cool touch, GM. I like it. Uh, let's go ahead and pop it right here. A little dusty. Um, we stopped uh, having the engines cleaned. We've had the power washing, some of these guys, especially if somebody doesn't know what they're doing. They ran into some trouble there, so we did stop doing that, but we will uh, obviously fully detail it here. But um, with that being said, nice and clean, 4.3 liter. No corrosion. Um, one thing to always look for is these little screw marks. You always want to kind of see that they actually haven't been worked on. That's one sign of knowing if a car has been in an accident or not. And all that looks clean. So definitely a nice little truck. Um, if you guys have any questions, obviously feel free to give me a call. You can always reach me at 248-892-9663 or simply hop on our website at www.cityofcars.com. There you're going to be able to find the window sticker, car facts, all the information you need as far as purchasing this truck. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and I hope everybody has a wonderful rest of the day.